Good morning. Rise and shine straight. <laughs> Don't worry, you guys. He slept in his crate last night, but I always bring him in bed with me in the morning. You ready for breakfast? I know I'm ready for mine, but you get breakfast first. Good boy, enjoy. Bon appetit. Time for my coffee. I'm on a decaf coffee grind, and it's pretty good life. Duncan decaf, baby. <laughs> All right, Brooke wanted me to call her, so a little Monday morning chat with our coffee. Good morning. Hi, good morning. <laughs> Finley, what's today's quote? Let's see. Doubt loves to dress up as logic. You guys, Safe Haven's now on Netflix. This is one of my favorite movies. Fun fact, Josh Duhamel is one of my like big celebrity crushes for some reason. Yummers! Oh, not for you. Good morning, everybody. It's Monday. I'm here with my roommate, Delaney. <laughs> we, I just realized I never started the vlog officially. Heading into Kroger right now, getting our groceries for the week, getting our stuff for our meals. We're doing pesto orzo, ground turkey tacos, chicken piccata, and chicken rice and green beans. So it's a big, big week. And also just need more kombucha and other essentials, so yeah. We're in the neutral vibes today, Delaney, I like it. Oh. And we're on another walk before I record the podcast. <laughs> hey there. All right, you guys, you know the Monday drill. It's Record Gals on the Go podcast this week. We're doing an advice episode. I'm so excited for Lance in the back. Hopefully it'll be good. Hey. All right, recording is over. Another great episode. Having, this is my favorite type of sushi, the vegetable combo. I also love California rolls. Got this bowl from Trader Joe's a while back and it's so perfect for soy sauce. I feel like I always wait days to change the oven because it's actually 408 because of, um, daylight savings, but we're gonna be productive and do this now because it always really confuses me. All right, we're about to go for another walk, third of the day. This one I'm gonna record for my walking class. We are now in College Square, got a smoothie. He's being a good boy. <laughs> we just got back from our walk. I got some ginger shots, stocked up, got my KO Slam. My friend Megan works there now too, so it's so fun we get to like catch up every time I'm there. Um, I love putting him on my bed because he can't get off and he just like stays there and looks so cute. Anyways, I want to show you guys these jeans. I really hope they fit right. My friend Kala has them and they look like the Zara jeans, but those are like super long and I'm hoping that these won't be as long. They're from Pretty Little Thing. I'll link them down below. I'm about to try them on and see. Okay, so I think I love these a lot. I definitely will need to wear like booties <laughs> or like platform sneakers with them, but I'm really into them. They're definitely a little baggy right here, but maybe I could get them tailored or something because I love the fit. I like how they're actually loose on my thighs. I've really struggled with that. They always like slim to my thighs, but the neat, the cuts are great. Yeah, these are really dope. All right, just finished doing some retail math homework and now Delaney and I are making dinner. I think tonight we decided on chicken piccata. Things are happening. This is Delaney's specialty. Chicken she got the recipe from her mama. Pasta always with it. Just took Finley for another walk. Gonna enjoy. Oh, he's just hanging in Delaney's room. Oh my gosh, a staple in this household. Yay. We decided it was only appropriate to have red wine this fine evening with this pasta. It's a red wine blend from Wink. I think my link still works. If you guys want your first month, $39 for four bottles, check it out. This one's called Funk Zone. Cheers. Hey guys, Danielle from the future. Um, I wanted to put this in kind of more at the beginning of the vlog because it's important to me and I know it's important to a lot of you guys and I think it's really important to kind of be aware of what's going on in the world right now. The recent acts of violence against Asian Americans is disgusting, it's not okay, and it's something that needs to be talked about and it's not something that I personally want to brush off and it's really important for me to kind of share that with you guys. I do not support any act of hate racism or discrimination against any Asian American, specific Islanders. 
it is absolutely not okay it's disgusting like i said before and i wanted to support in some sort of way i can and kind of by using my platform here to share that with you guys my heart goes out to all of you that might have experienced something like this in your life or a family member a friend it is a tough time and i totally get it obviously i haven't experienced it myself but i am sending love and support and one way that we can support is by supporting and shopping from asian american owned businesses so i actually came up with a list on my phone i did some research and purchased some on my own as well and i'll link all these down below for you guys to check out but it's just one easy way from home that you can show your support there's also a gofundme i believe it's gofundme.com slash aapi i'll also link some other resources down below if you kind of want to learn more about it i've been posting some stuff on my instagram stories as well but i felt it was really important to put it in a youtube video i wanted to look for more fashion and beauty related um, companies because i felt like it was something that might resonate with you guys and something that you might be looking to shop for anyways um so the first one i actually just purchased a mask from nunchi masks I might be pronouncing some of these wrong, I'm trying. I just got this really beautiful um, handmade houndstooth um, mask and I'll link it down below for you guys to check out. Amio jewelry, they have beautiful jewelry. Avre sneakers, they're very sustainable too, I'm pretty sure, which is awesome. Clean Circle, it's a beauty and skincare company. Chunks hair clips, we actually talked about them on Gals on the Go, that'll be up this coming Wednesday. They have the coolest hair clips, you guys, like super colorful, super vibrant, very on trend. Corvi, they have eyewear. Glamnetic, I've actually heard of them before. They're like, I believe they're fake lashes, but they're magnetic, I think, which is pretty cool. And then we've got Mobby, which is a fashion line. They have beautiful clothing. Definitely suggest checking them out. And the last one I found is Mohala. And they also have, you know, sunglasses, eyewear. And yeah, so I'll link those down below for you guys as well as the other things that I mentioned. I just thought it was important and I wanted to share them with you guys. And it's a really important time and we can make change just in this small little way by acknowledging it and you know condemning it yeah anyways i will resume this vlog but i felt it was important happy tuesday you guys guys huge news this morning finley peed on the turf on my balcony he did last night he like scratched it on the door and so we opened it and he immediately went and peed on the grass. <laughs> so I don't always have to like go all the way outside like for those early mornings and late night. About to hop on my creativity and the design process class. <laughs> oh my God, he might be about to pee again. All right, Finley, let's go to class. Come on, let's go to class. <laughs> Now time for my breakfast. No, not for you. Just went for a little parking deck walk with him because it's raining. All right, you guys, so it's just a rainy Tuesday. Finn and I are on the couch. Delaney's in her room studying. I've got a list of things to do on my planner. Um, I have to reply to three discussion posts for this ready-to-wear project I did for my brand management class. To do my reading circle for my textile econ class. I already did my team eval forms for my management project. I wanna watch Outer Banks again. <laughs> That's on my to-do list, <laughs> so I don't forget. I need to finalize my grad pick outfits for my solo grad picks, because I want them to be, you know, obviously cool. And then I just need to edit my girl talk Q&A that I filmed a couple days ago. So, got my study buddy here, He's being so cute and cuddly. Today's lunch, finishing my sushi from yesterday because I never finished it. All right, you guys, it's a little bit later. It's still this gloomy day. We just went for a long walk. Yes, we did. I'm drinking a LaCroix and I got a lot of, got a lot of schoolwork done and then I edited my Girl Talk Q&A, which I think came out really well. So that'll already be up by the time you guys are watching this. Go check it out. I am like in this mood to watch Outer Banks. I don't know why. I think it's just this feeling. It like makes me feel like it's summer and I just cannot wait for summer. Like I'm, I'm, I can wait, but I'm like so excited. I love just 
the feel I get when I watch Outer Banks. I don't know if anyone else feels that way. So I'm gonna pop it on and see if Finley naps a little bit. I love when he falls asleep on my bed. It's so cute. Like he sleeps in the crate at night, obviously, but oh, it's the most tender thing around this time of day. He gets so sleepy. In my walking PE class, we have to wear our fitness tracker basically all waking hours he said for the next seven days and track our steps so yeah it's kind of annoying because i don't wear this like all the time but um it'll be cool to see like more of a consistent activity because i pretty much just wear it if i'm going for a walk or from working out um and for other little convenient things just gave finley a good brush oh outer banks is on vibes are good Okay, you guys, we're gonna do a little unboxing haul. I just got some packages. I am so excited about this. I have become obsessed with the Yeezy slides. However, they are so expensive and um, I just didn't wanna spend that. So I found dupes on Amazon. I just wanted a pair of slides that I could just wear day to day that have like a little platform. These literally look like the Yeezy slides. I'm obsessed. They're just like this sand colored and I just think they're gonna look so sick with leggings, if I'm just lounging, or with like sweats, or when it's summertime. Oh my gosh, I wanna put these on. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Kinda goes with the fit right now. Wow, this is like a legal feeling. They feel so good to walk on. I got a normal Kong ball, cause I have a Kong, but we used to use one of these with Miley, cause the other one, it like has two ends. This one is great because it'll take them longer to like get in there. This thing, I really hope it works. We'll see if he likes it. It's a puppy teething toy um, and it's got these like bristles on it. And apparently it feels really good on their gums and their teeth since they're teething. And then I got these puppy teething treats. They had great reviews. <laughs> and lastly, my parents forgot to bring one of his favorite toys. Um, and it's like a crinkle toy. So when he chews on it, it's kind of like, sounds like a water bottle or something. And they had all these different animals that I picked this one. It's like a, I think it's a tiger. And you can also play tug of war with it. It's multifaceted, so. <laughs> He's gonna love that one. Rope for tug of war, cause he loves to pull on things. Oh, I know he's gonna love that Kringle toy. He loves that one at home. All right, Finley Bear is enjoying his new puppy teething treat. I'm so excited. About to hop on my call with someone at YouTube. It's so fun. Every month or every two months, we kind of just do a little check-in, brainstorm video ideas, kind of look at what videos of mine do well and what don't and I don't know, I love it. My girl Jody, she's awesome, and I'm so excited to chat with her. I made a cup of decaf coffee because I'm tired, <laughs> because that's gonna help, but for some reason, just the act, you guys know how I am, the act of making coffee in general, just, ugh. All right guys, it's Taco Tuesday night. We're doing ground turkey tacos, and I realized that I forgot to buy more taco seasoning. However, we looked it up, and we have like all of the spices that you would use to create your own taco seasoning, which is like, Chili powder, garlic powder, onion powder, red pepper flakes, which we don't have, we don't love spice anyways. Oregano, we don't have paprika, cumin, salt, and pepper. So, I mean, we're just gonna do that. And I bought tortillas as well. Um, and then we have to pop up tomatoes, lettuce. Um, I got some iceberg and normal sized tomatoes. And we have um, this cheese blend for the tacos as well. All right, taco seasoning is made. We'll see how it goes with it. Hopefully good. All right, things are looking good. Adding some avocado as well. The meat's done. Heating up the tortillas. Taco Tuesday, baby. Yum, yum. All right, on another walk outside. It's a beautiful night. It's a little chillier tonight. It's not raining anymore, so I wanted to take him actually out. We've been doing parking garage walks. Oh, good boy. Oh, I just took a shower. I feel so clean. And we are about to watch The Last Blockbuster. It's a documentary on Netflix. You excited? So yeah, we'll let you guys know if it's good. It's about, we used to go to Blockbuster all the time to rent movies, so it's, it'll be interesting to hear the history. We're watching Ginny and Georgia on episode two. Obsessed. Finley eating his bully stick, trying smart sweets for the first time. Pretty good. Just thought I'd update. Good morning, sleepyhead. 
morning, you guys. It's 10 a.m. I shouldn't have slept in. I swear daylight savings is still getting to me. I always take Finley out of his crate and then we sleep together for like another hour. It's very cute. We've got a really busy day ahead of us. So I have no business in waking up this late, but let's get to it. It's breakfast time, baby. Come here. <gasps> yum, 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 yum. Bringing out the old Dan Fam merch. Vintage at this point. Flowers need time to bloom, so do you. Love it, let's fill it out. Also, if you guys are wondering, these are the planners that I designed. This is one day on each page. This is like the motivational side. This is like the get after it kind of side. I love it. We have a work and a side hustle to do list. Your schedule, self care, mood, act of kindness, your affirmations for the day. I love this thing so much. Kind of getting towards the end not excited about that but yeah i'll have it linked down below for you guys it's still on sale and it's the best what's that come on this is such an easy and great breakfast tortilla eggs texas peat hot sauce so yum guys delaney comes out here and pinches me and i told her i wouldn't pinch her yet she was in her pee Jeez. Just took a quick body shower in time to join my Zoom. It's an optional Zoom for my retail planning and buying class, but it's for our exam um, next Monday. It's like a review, and I definitely want to tune in, so I'm connecting. I'm just not going to show my camera because... <laughs> All right, you guys. Just finished my exam review. This outfit may change. I don't really know. I just decided to put on some makeup. It's my little green shirt for the day. It's from ASOS, it's a little bandana top. Jeans, Princess Polly, love these. Boots, Mark Fisher. A little chilly out, so I'm wearing this leather jacket from Zara. Outfit's kind of all over the place, but I need to head out. The reason I'm kind of dressed up is I'm headed to a fitting for Strike Magazine, one of our shoots that we're doing. I'm the stylist for this one, and I'm so excited. Delaney's actually a model for it. I'm gonna go help with the fitting for that. Pretty pumped. And Finley's gonna go hang out with his uncle. It's Ryan's best friend. Right, so the fitting got rescheduled to tomorrow because they're still waiting on one piece for the look. And I can't go tomorrow, sadly, but that's okay. I just went and got a pair of jeans altered that I got. The ones I showed you guys earlier in this vlog. Just got the waist tuck pulled in. Anyways, I'm just gonna let my friend hang out with Finley for a little bit because I just dropped them off and I could use a moment alone. I feel like a mom that finally got a babysitter for her child. All right, you guys, he's back from his uncle's. I'm gonna stop saying that, it's really weird. I'm like so sleepy right now, but I have some homework that's literally due tonight, so I have to do it tonight. And I'm so happy I posted this girl talk um, Q&A for you guys today. And everyone like loved it. And I'm just so happy that you guys really enjoyed it. I definitely am gonna do another. I guess because I talked about stuff I don't normally talk about, like birth control and flirting and just random stuff. So now that I know you guys are into that, we'll keep the ball rolling for sure. Just grab a kombucha out of the fridge while he's napping and trying to do my homework, even though like I literally don't want to, but I don't really know. Since it's St. Patrick's Day, I think I'm gonna meet up with Ryan and we're gonna have a beer or two. That's like our thing. Um, I saw him briefly yesterday, but we've just been so busy the weekdays. We just like, we live so close, but it's like, but it's kind of nice because we both know, okay, I know you're near, but we're both busy. So like, whatever, we'll link up. And then we're always together like, all weekend so it kind of works out i'm going to do my retail math homework which is gonna hurt my brain i just know it <laughs> and then um this reading discussion i have to do for my textile econ class and i switched into this shirt from Urban Outfitters. good morning you guys it's thursday let's make today a good ass day <laughs> it's a thursday morning and we think the rain has finally stopped just chilling with the boy. About to head on to Therapy. Therapist is gonna meet Finstar. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it's gonna be a good day. We're gonna make it a good day. The sun's coming out. I can see it. I can see it. Oh, blue skies. Me putting on earrings for therapy. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why. I just like if I have my hair on my face, I feel like it looks so much better if I have earrings in. Mm. Okay, now I'm self-conscious. I'll just leave my hair down. Well, I just made breakfast and was about to take Finley for
after a long, long walk because the sun was coming out. And now it just started to pour rain. Like, it was literally sunny. Look at all of that fresh berry goodness. The sun came out just as I was finishing my breakfast. So, I mean, perfect timing. All right, you guys. The sun is out now. We're gonna go for a walk with Finley. I think today's the day I get a caffeinated coffee. <laughs> I think I'm gonna mobile order a Starbucks. We're gonna walk around, I'll pick it up, walk with Finley a bit, and then I've got a meeting at two, and then Brooker and I are recording Gals on the Go for next week at three, and I've lots of homework. And yeah, so, but it's beautiful out. I wanna get some, some walking minutes in, and it's just good for the soul. All right, first caffeine in like two weeks. I got a little tall iced coffee all right hopping on my meeting and do you guys know one of my tricks is putting my hair behind my ears or a claw clip gold hoop earrings and blue light glasses and i added a necklace so it looks like i'm a little bit more professional just finished our call it was great and i got a package in the mail from aritzia i placed an order because if you guys don't notice um i wear just a ton of basics all the time like especially like basic tank tops and after a while they just get pilled up they get old they get gross and so i wanted to place a new order in and i love aritzia's basics i love all their tanks and stuff so, oh my god, it's so cute. It's just, I love how they like don't do all this plastic or anything. It's just folded up in a shopping bag. We love that. Um, So this tank, I literally already had, but I've had it for like two years now, maybe a year and a half, and it was so pilled up. So it's just this one. I think it's called the Wilfred, literally the Wilfred tank. And it's just this black crop tank with like spaghetti straps or even thinner, really. Um, I love it. I love wearing it sweatpants or jeans. I wore it a lot last summer. And then this one is a gray ribbed crop top. Um, I love I love shirts like this. I find them very flattering with this kind of cut. And I think this is going to look great with some lighter blue jeans. Um, and you can just wear them so many different ways. Like with midi skirts if you want. There's just so many different options. And I just like to have them on hand. So got a black one of the same type i believe similar to this one this one's a little bit softer a little nicer quality very 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 comfortable went a little crazy and got a red one um same idea this one's a little bit different shape it's more like wide in the front actually not really that much it's also ribbed but i didn't have like a ribbed red tank this one i love blue right now as you guys know you guys have been really really hyping me up when i wear blue so thank you <laughs> um i got this one it's more of a lower cut it's just like a beautiful columbia blue color i think this is so exciting for spring to wear with like a little skirt and some flat form got this really pretty green color it's ribbed as well Oh my god, it's so soft and so comfortable. I literally cannot wait. Like, basically, I just got rid of 10 tanks. Um, I donated them, but they were just, I mean, someone will love them, but they were just getting, like, blah. Some of them I had to throw away, actually. So, it's a big stock up. Love this one. It's a little bit thicker material. It's from TNA, their brand. This is, like, a light, dusty pink color. Love it. And then I'm also into green. Blue and green are, like, my colors right now, which I never thought I'd ever say. So, especially green. But I love this hunter green color, I think that would be called. Hunter green, it's a little thread. But it's so beautiful. I think this is a great transition color from winter to spring. Um, it's kind of like a winter evergreen color, but then also it's like, yay, colors, spring. It's also a fitted one. They had matching leggings with this, but I didn't really need it because it's not like something I'd work out in. It's totally just like whatever. But I love these shirts to wear with like different layered necklaces and they're just, you can pair them so many different ways. So it's like this brown taupey color. But now Brooke and I are about to record uh, next week's episode of Gals and the Ghost. By the time you guys are watching this, it'll be up this coming Wednesday. And we're doing a part two to what we wish we knew before coming to college. So if we recorded one two years ago when she was still here and I was only like a sophomore, I think. So things have obviously changed and we have new perspectives as well. Cause now I'm about to graduate and she's graduated now. So I came up with a ton of things for that and we're gonna do that episode, so it's a solo episode, just the two of us. And then Ryan's gonna pick up Finley and they're gonna have some guy time. And I literally feel like a mom that got a babysitter again. It's so funny and he's gonna play around with Finley. So yeah, I'm very thankful for his help.
dropping Finley off with Ryan to play for a couple hours. Just got my weekly spray tan from a Golden Sunless Tan here in Athens. She's the best of the best. If you live in Athens, go to her. You make an appointment, you don't have to like wait in line, it's like the best. Um, yeah, I'm Finley free. I love Finley, you guys know that, but it's nice to like, cause now I'm gonna go back and Delaney and I are gonna like deep clean the apartment. I'm gonna like make my bed and do stuff. I said I was gonna shower, but I'm just gonna wash my hair tomorrow cause I'll have to shower off the spray tan um, and make dinner and like just relax. Ryan was like, literally just let me know when you want me to bring him back. And I was like, literally, I love you so much. All right, so I'm cleaning right now. I just cleaned my whole room. I cleaned out my closet a little bit and clean the kitchen with Delaney, and I just got more packages in the mail. Guys, I ordered this. I've been on the email list for Telfar, and they finally released this hat. I saw this hat a couple months ago, or maybe like a month, month or two ago, I don't really know, and I just needed this like brown hat. This is so sick, and they emailed me and was like, it's back in stock, so I immediately bought it right away. I just think this is so dope. I don't have like a hat this color. Finally got this in the mail. I ordered this a couple weeks ago. It's the Outdoor Voices. It's the exercise dress. I got a size small. Hopefully it fits right. Um, but yeah, it's got a squirt underneath and so many of my friends just like I've noticed wear this on campus. They go to class in this. They'll run errands in it. And it's just so easy because you just pop it on. They had so many fun colors. Like there was red that I really wanted to get. But I wanted to see if I wore it first. I'd be so open to getting more colors. But um, yeah, I'm really, really pumped about this. It's good material. I feel like it's great for as it's warming up. Just on the go outfit. And it finally came in the mail. I'm so pumped. Finley's back from Ryan's house. They went on a long walk around the lake, played, I guess he did some tennis fetching, tennis ball fetching. Um, tonight's dinner, <laughs> I messed up and we were gonna make our famous pesto orzo. However, I forgot to get orzo and I had this spinach fettuccine, so we're gonna do that. So basically it's fettuccine, cherry tomatoes, zucchini, and pesto, and it's delicioso. So, boiling the water now, it's gonna be great. All right, we've got, this only took 30 minutes. 30. Or 30. <laughs> this only took three minutes. All right, it's done. We'll keep you guys posted on if it's good. Good morning, it's Friday. The sun is out. Got some decaf coffee. Just showered, about to go get some bagels with Ryan. All right, I didn't have time to completely style my hair, so I just blew it dry for now. Here's my outfit. Top is from Amazon. Jacket is from ASOS. Sweatpants are shop. Hey, Ray. Hello, Ryan. Hello, Morning. Finley. <laughs> Morning. Okay, so Ryan's telling me today is like a national holiday. Yep, it's March Madness season. What? He goes, it's probably like my top three favorite holidays, you know, after Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, he literally has his like paper bracket in his pocket and he's pulled it out every couple minutes just to like check it again. Well, the real ones are like in the tournaments, you put them in online, but the paper one's just like a hard copy I can keep. So I don't have to like look at my phone. You're so, you're so traditional. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I love it. It's a beautiful day. Finley's settled down under the table here. All right, you guys. So I just had a meeting with my professor. She wanted to do like one-on-one. -on -one check in with us. I went to CVS and I bought Finley some more little training treats. Um, they're like little soft moist ones and some more canned food because we mix like a little of the soft food with the hard food and he's so spoiled. Just finishing up my homework for the week. I want to get editing this video. Delaney's at a fitting for a model photo shoot. She, she's a model. I don't even know. She's so cool. She's in Atlanta. I love you guys so much. I hope you all enjoyed this week's Week in My Life with Finley. <laughs> and um, yeah, make sure to go check out those Asian American owned businesses that I talked about earlier or support in any way you can or at least acknowledge that it's happening right now. I'll have those down below. Without further ado, I will, well, I will end this vlog. <laughs> Bye guys.